Uh, magandang hapon po sa inyong lahat. Uh, una po sa lahat, ako po'y nagpapasalamat sa Panginoon Diyos for the opportunity. Yeah, uh, uh, dito po sa harapan po ninyo. And then second po, I'd like to thank the President for uh, inviting me to join the coalition. Uh, the President asked me kung uh, gusto ko pang uh, tulungan ang uh, administrasyon. So I said yes. I'd also like to thank the uh, Speaker of the House for inviting me to join Lakas CMD. Why Lakas CMD? Because I believe Lakas CMD, Christian Muslim Democrats, encompasses everybody. Hindi lang po Kristiyano, hindi lang po Muslim. And when you say Muslim, kasama na po dyan ang mga katutubo and the Democrats. So, yun po, kaya po tayo sumama sa lakas CMD because of that belief na everybody po kasama. Why lakas CMD? Because nakita ko po halos pareho po ang adhikain namin at ng lakas. Nakafocus po ngayon ang lakas sa pagtulong po sa mga kababayan natin ng mga mahihirap Poverty alleviation, yan po yung marching order ng Pangulo. And ever since naman po nakatuon po kami ang magkakapatid sa pagtulong po sa mga may hirap at mga inapi. Uh, if God uh, wills it, tayo ipapala rin, we will start working on day one immediately. Maraming maraming salamat po. If you have questions, you can ask Anong now. Po? From Malaya Business Insight, Gerard Nabal. Sir? Uh, good afternoon, sir. Sir, isang question lang, sir. Uh, you're running under the administration, sir. Administration coalition, sir. Yes. Will you be, will there be an opportunity for you to campaign with your brother? Uh, pag nakita siguro kami, uh, I believe he's running as independent, si uh, Ben. So, uh, why, why not, di ba? Alam ba naman, he's na bin ko siya. When uh, we see each other in the same sortie o sa isang lugar, of course, I mean, uh, I'll, I'll have to help him out. Hi, sir. Good afternoon po. Yeah. Sir, sorry, the elephant in the room po is that there are um, comments po that there will be political dynasty po because Sir Ben is also running po. You're also running. And Senator Rafi po is currently at the Senate. Sir, any comments on the political dynasty? Well, as long as there's no law yet, then uh, we let the people decide. Di po ba? Kung ngayon, kung may batas na ho, then we stop. Uh, yung political dynasty, matagal na pong usapin ho yan eh. And I believe, hindi po titigil yan hanggang wala pong batas. Luzon, Visayas, Mindanao. Kaya, uh, ang tao ho will decide. For now, dahil wala po tayong batas, then let the people decide. Do we want one tulfo, two tulfos, three tulfos? Do we want them? One Duterte, two Duterte, three Dutertes? One Marcos, two Marcos, three Marcos? Uh, LGUs, maraming ganyan. So, we, we let the people decide. Nasa kapangyarihan po ng tao. Kung gusto po nila si Rafi lang, fine. Wala akong problema. Gusto nila ang dalawa, fine. Gusto nila ang tatlong tulfo sa Senado. Nasa tao po yun eh. Because we don't have a law. If there's a law, then that's it. Matitigil po yan. Sir, do you think, don't you think, sir, parang prone po siya abuse for some family po na parang nahuhold lang nila yung power within their families, especially in the provinces, sir? Um, uh, I cannot speak for the provinces, boss, because I'm not uh, running for the national election, I mean, uh, uh, local elections in the LGU. I'm running po in the national uh, elections. Kaya I cannot speak about abuses po sa LGU. I don't know what's going on down there sa LGU because... Wala pa po sa amin ang tumatakbo sa local government units. From ABS-CBN, Kat Domingo. Hi, sir. Good morning. Sir, should you win a seat in the Senate, will you be willing to support or advocate for an anti-dynasty law? Yes. We, no, what I mean to say is like, if there is a law, then pag-uusapan ng majority, you know that it's numbers game, di po ba? Uh, you may say yes, pero yung mga kasamahan mo, majority rules. We, we will look. Paano yung forma ng dynasty, yung sinasabi niyo dynasty law? Kung nandyan na yan, kung maganda naman yun, para makakatulong po sa sambayan, then, then I will. Why not, di ba? If, if it's, if it's for, for the benefit 
of the, the whole nation para mapagbigyan ng lahat, then why, why not, di ba? Sir, how will you convince voters that the public needs another tool for in the Senate? Performance, ma'am. Performance. Uh, I will just add, tell them to look at my older, my, my older brother, uh, what he had done in uh, Senate, and what I have done in Congress. Tignan na lang nila sa performance. Sir, we all know last na po, there are three tulfos running for, uh, there are two tulfos running for senator. If both of you wins, there will be three tulfos in the Senate. What is your unique selling proposition compared to your brothers? Well, um, all of us like our... Uh, uh, pro-poor yung plataforma lagi namin. Pero this time, we have marching orders from the administration to continue yung uh, programs ng uh, pamalaan, uh, poverty alleviation, etc. Ayun naman talaga, kahit ka, lahat kami magkakapatid. Pero we always forget the one in the middle. Yung mga middle class, yung mga uring manggagawa. Nakakalimutan minsan or kadalasan naiiwan. Because nakafocus ang sentro ng gobyerno ngayon sa mga nasa laylayan. Papano yung nasa middle class? Papano yung mga professionals? Yung mga below middle class? Yung mga nagtatrabaho sa mga fast food? Mga sales clerk? Mga gwardiya? Uh, papano sila? Di ba? Because we, we are so focused yung gobyerno so, sa mga mahihirap. Siguro it's time we also look at doon sa mga kababayan natin na mga hindi masyado napapansin yung nasa middle Siguro yung sinisigaw nila na higher wages, yung mga more benefits. And I will also introduce, uh, if there's a chance, yung retirement siguro benefits ng mga nagtatrabaho sa pub, uh, private sector. Jeffrey Hernandez, ABS-CBN. Hi, Sir Erwin. Sir, so we might see three tools po, po sa Senate, no? There's a possibility. So paano po ba ang aasahan namin? Ang, ang boto po ba ng isang tool po ay boto ng tatlo? Ang stand po ba ng isang uh, tool po sa Senado ay magiging stand ng tatlo? Doon po patutungo yun, eh. Because uh, iisa lang naman po yung uh, layunin namin. Alam niyo naman from the very start, Rafi, even before we joined the politics, nakasentro po sa pagtulong sa mga mahihirap, uh, defend doon sa mga oppressed. So doon ho yun eh. Uh, mas maganda ho, mas maraming puwersa, ika nga. Follow-up question lang po. Sir, nakapag-usap po, po, po ba kayo ni Sir Ben Tulfo na napag-usapan ba na isa lang sa inyong tatakbo o napagkasundoan na takbo na lang po pareho? Uh, takbo na lang pareho. This is a free country. So sabi nga namin, magkakapatid, Eh, sige, if you want to run, then, then uh, so be it. Uh, mahirap naman ho yung uh, pipigilan mo. Eh, mas makakatulong nga, ika nga, you have the numbers.